It's six o'clock. We talked to you at eight o'clock in the morning. You've been up since five o'clock. Yeah, uh, last night. Yeah, I went to bed late. I mean, I'm on like two hours of sleep. Passing out flyers still at all the bars around here. Um, working on things for the, you know, the the copy for the announcer, all sorts of things. And right now, I just feel like it's over. I can have some wine. I can uh, relax. Everything it looks all it's all peace and quiet now. It looks a lot different than before, right? My name is Damian Gonzalez. I'm uh, one of the race directors of the Lodi Cycle Fest. I'm also a professional triathlete. I also race for the Michael David Winery cycling team, which is the title sponsor of the Lodi Cycle Fest. They've been a primary sponsor for um, our team for, I want to say, five years now. They've been a fantastic partner every single step of the way. I'm David Phillips, and uh, my brother Michael and I have been sponsoring this event since 2009, so this is the fifth year we've done it, and it just keeps getting better and better every year, and we're thrilled to bring this event to Lodi. About five years ago, um, myself and three other uh, officers from our, our cycling club, Delta Bello, uh, were contemplating putting together a criterium, which is this race style that we have today. Criteriums are a fun because you get to see all sorts of different towns that you would never see traveling all over the state. And Lodi is such a, such a fun little town with all the little wineries, and it's really a great way to showcase the, the downtown area. Lodi's great. It's family-oriented, uh, a lot of family wineries, good wine, um, nice community. Um, these guys are all family, and I've gotten to know them and their family, so Lodi's like that. It's a, it's a good place to be. If you look now, it's gotten a lot heavier, it's a lot, a lot more traffic. People really do enjoy it down here. This venue down here with all the, the brick and cobblestones, um, tight corners, and the downtown venue, the shade, it's hands down, it's a great race. We are all safe and we love Cycle Fest 2013. A criterium is more like NASCAR, where it's a short course, super fast, aggressive. These types of races, they're, they're pretty intense. This course here in Lodi is in the shape of a figure eight. So it's on the more technical side, there's a lot of corners. You have to be kind of geared towards racing criteriums. And uh, the bar banging, rubbing yeah, shoulders, going around the corner, banging and staying, and staying calm. You got cyclists all around you, you're going like 30 miles an hour around corners, and you're redlining. I mean, you're going 100%, and you just got to hold it together and not crash and not cross the wheels or anything like that. Yeah. You do everything right, someone else makes mistakes. Yeah. I used to not like it at all because it's fast and scary, but I'm riding smarter and you get the experience. You know, try not to crash. <laughs> I mean, every time I've crashed, it was always somebody else's fault. They're going to ride into me, chop my wheel, or this and that. But that's the risk to take for the love of the sport. Nobody really puts together an event like this where all the wineries, you know, come out and compete in a fun beach cruiser race. You know, they dress up in costume, uh, they get judged on their costume, and they get points for their finishing place. They're competing for the Vintner's Cup, which is uh, the, this, the nice trophy that was handmade by a local artist, and the winner will get their name engraved on it, and they get to keep it for a, a whole year until next year's Lodi Cycle Fest. Phillips family of Michael David Winery have really been responsible for, you know, kicking this thing off. I think uh, that would be a fun thing if we had, you know, French or Australian winemakers come to Lodi to race in a winemaker's race. That would be really fun. And we're encouraging other wineries to get involved, get their own cycling teams out there, and, and getting out and racing. For the Vintners Cup, you know, we all root for him, hopefully, to win the event. 
Um, it hasn't in the past three years, it hasn't happened, but with that outrageous outfit that he wore, I think that's what won him the race. Um, it's just people were speechless. We're really happy to be a sponsor for the Cycle Fest. We're glad that anything that can bring more people downtown, we want to be a part of. I think it's a great way to get involved with the community and let the community know that we are here to uh, support them. It's a great town. Um, it's grown over the years. I can't believe we're in Lodi. <laughs> yeah, it's like transformed downtown. Yeah. I'm always excited for the Cycle Fest. I love just coming out and enjoying the stores and stuff like the Lodi Brewery. Uh, places like that we can just kind of hang out, chill. And then at the same time you're seeing something that you don't usually see in Lodi. It's, it's a lot of fun. I think the general atmosphere is very positive and, and it's really nice. And it's almost like a fair with the bicycle race involved. It's a lot of fun. We like cycling ourselves. We're a big cyclist. Not racing wise, but it's a really neat sport to watch. This is my second time doing it. I missed last year because I was traveling, but two years ago I was here announcing and it was a great time. I couldn't wait to come back. And uh, Lodi Cycle Fest, they do it on one of the best venues in, uh, in all of NorCal. I think my favorite thing is watching all the competition and just they're having a great time. The people enjoy it. I think it's just a neat thing and I hope they continue doing it every year. My favorite would be the kids, see all the little kiddos get out there and race. <laughs> this is exactly what the Cycle Fest is for, is for kids. It's a kid-friendly event. They can race, they can watch pros race. All right, ladies and gentlemen, please clear the course because we are about to release the four, five, six, and seven speed demons as they come race roaring down. On your mark, get set, go! One of the major differences between this race and what you'll see at other criteriums is the introduction and um, really inclusion of hand cycling. Hand cycling is about handicapped individuals, so paralyzed from the waist down, generally speaking, who don't have full use of their legs, and their primary mode of getting around is, you know, pumping everything that we would go to the gym and do large, you know, upper body workouts. Just imagine 700 reps on a Brent, on a bench press. That's what these guys are doing out there and it's fantastic to watch them go. I'm originally from South Dakota, and I moved to uh, Lodi in 1967 with my family. Last year I had Taya Rosa. My name is Taya Rosa, and I'll be competing in the hand cycle category this morning at the Lodi Cycle Fest. I'm into my 10th year. I got hurt in a horse riding accident. This last year, we just had this really wonderful friendship. You know, we have a lot of uh, cycling friends that we help each other out that way. So it's good. So I've met wonderful people. I met, you know, people here in Lodi. I would, I'd like to motivate and inspire people if I can. The ones that are ready to give up. To see that, no, you know, we don't have to. Life goes on no matter what happens. I want to set a good example because anything can really happen in life and we can't stop living. You got to count your blessings. I'm still here and life is good.
my name is Roman Killen, and I just won the Lodi Cycle Fest Criterium. Uh, actually, my wife won the women's race, and she wins a lot more races than I do, so it's <laughs> nice when I can uh, win on the same day. We've had this wine, and we both really like it, so we'll probably have a big party and celebrate with some of our friends. Winning is fun, and the Lodi Cycle Fest is just a great event. I like it. One word, the day that there's winemakers here, traveling here from all over the world, that's the day that I'm gonna say this is epic and this is exactly what I was trying to accomplish here.